Why did nobody tell me about her admission? Uh, Irene Sanders entered... Oh, it's Irene! Uh, Fuller and the Hanman recommend to take her down to the psychiatric wing in order to provide her with the quiet and rest she needs. Oh, this is Irene Sanders! Mrs. Sanders? Her husband was here. That's the guy that had, like, the bandages over his eyes and stuff. Can't talk to you. What do we have over here? Anything? Not really, no. Oh, wait. What is the boiler room key doing here? The key to the boiler room. Oh, why don't I Not take it? Not where I expected to find it. Why don't I, you know, take it? But oh well, I guess I can't do that. What's this? Intoxication from breathing organic vapors. Huh. What are Another you? insomniac. I should find the cause for such a widespread trouble. No one's here in this one anyway. And that guy was just there and you are apparently bleeding from your mouth. I'd say that's a rather serious issue, but all right, I guess I don't have a comment on that. <laughs> Okay, we need to look for a lady. Hawkins Wing. Who are you? It's a quiet little town. Days go by, steady as ever. I wanted more for myself, but... I, I don't understand what you were talking about, but sure, okay, what, what, whatever. Hi. Dr. Colden. Yes, that, that would be I. That would be me. What are you guys? Oh, hey! Ethan. Marie, I... What are you doing here? I'm waiting for my medication, of course. Why? Oh, she's got master at medicine. Tell me your symptoms. I have headaches. And I can't sleep. Do you suffer from insomnia? No. Look, I don't want you to laugh at me. Ethan, if you don't trust me, then who? I have nightmares. They keep me awake every night. Oh. It seems stupid, I know, but they're terrible. Actually, you're not the only one. No. No one has ever seen the things I see. It's like I'm turning mad. <laughs> so many people have this affliction. It's like an epidemic. Do you think it might be related to Fuller's work? I don't know yet, but I will figure all this out. Everyone in Darkwater is suffering from nightmares. Really? We don't have any medication left. Oh. There's no excuse then. I should let you work. Take care, Ethan. You too, Marie. He's not a bad guy. I don't get why they have us waiting so long. Almost uh. no patients here. No, there's quite a few. Did you look back there? Because if you hadn't looked back there, there's a few of them. Where did my fiancé go? I hope those nutcases will stop burdening her with work. I don't know. Okay. Let's see. In theory, this is where we hang the key to the boiler room. Dr. Fuller always keeps his key with him. Hmm. Dr. Colden, we need you at once in Dormitory B. Oh. What is the problem? Mr. Evans seems to be having trouble with his IV. I've done an exam. Deborah is looking after him. And the family of Mrs. Harding is asking to see her medical file. Oh. I'll never understand why it's so hard to see patients' files around here. Rules are rules. See, with Dr. Fuller, he's in charge. Anyhow, they're still waiting, and I don't think they'll leave until they get what they want. Understood. Anything else? 
As a matter of fact, yes. A man has been brought up from the basement. Ooh. Oh. What state is he in now? You should go see for yourself, Doctor. Hmm. Okay. What's this? This man, Edward Pierce. His file is incomplete. What did Fuller do to him? Wasn't that... Us? Isn't Pierce us? Hmm. Yeah, we're Pierce. Normally. Normally we are anyway. Right now we're not. What's in here? Any? Sorry, but Look. nobody can take anything until I finish the inventory. Oh. Please. The fewer interruptions uh, there I'm are, not the faster allowed... I'll be finished. Okay, I'm just not even allowed in here. My 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 apologies. Who are you guys? Hi. And who are you? You're no one. Okay. It's good to know. The operating room is never accessible after an operation. Okay. Let's hope I can go through the administration office. I see. I see. And that's why. I don't have any business in the boiler room. She's not gonna let us get that, and this guy is just sitting out here. All right, that's fine. Pharmacy, what's here? The doses prescribed by Fuller are far too high. Hmm. We're running out of this medicine. I know, Doctor. We sent the purchase order, though, but Mrs. Donovan refused it. Once again. Can't you do anything? Donovan takes her instructions directly from Dr. Fuller. I'm afraid I can do nothing about it for the moment. I see. Pseudoscientific work by Cesare Lombrosco correlates individual's morphology with his criminal predispositions. Uh, interesting. But false. We've been waiting to be restocked for weeks. I see. I think I've done most of the full circuit. I haven't gone into administration yet. That's what I'm doing now. Okay. I wasn't sure if I was allowed in here before, so I kind of avoided it, but it looks like I gotta go in here anyway, so... Leave these doors open so that I know I've been in here. I assume we're gonna have to end up going to the, uh, boiler room at some point. Reference book of medical science. Uh... All medical scientists known and practice in the modern world. That's a lot. Anything here? No. I have little time for you, Doctor. Oh, this is You'll find out that it's not only the doctors who have things to do. Ah, that's Miss Donovan. The one that nobody- Wait a minute. Where do you think you're going? Oh. Dr. Colden. Mrs. Donovan. Nobody goes into Dr. Fuller's office. But rest assured, I'll tell him you came by. That won't be necessary. Thank you. I will tell him, nonetheless. I see. Hmm. So, she won't let us in. The only other place I can recall... Oh, wait, we can go here. The answers must be hidden in Fuller's office. Oh, I can't go there. That's a lie. An old hag. I didn't make this up. And I'm the one okay, what else can I do here? This guy. I'm I'm I need to find that lady. 
Is it her? Ah, so there's Harding. She's still sleeping. Given her file, a nephrectomy would have been inevitable. But Fuller was able to save her kidney. I don't know what a nephrectomy is, but I'm guessing it means that they remove the kidney. Okay, so we found her. We can talk to these guys. So, Doctor, have you been able to examine our mother? I've tended to her, and I have good news. Her blood analysis is reassuring. Her kidneys are as new. Are you talking about the same person? This is miraculous. So Dr. Fuller She's still is... Recovering, but you may speak to her upon her awakening. Oh, mm. thank you so much, Doctor. We'll wait for her to wake up. We've been here since this morning, so it won't make a difference. Okay. Oh, I see what we're doing. We cut off the water. Okay, so... Dr. Fuller's experiments are able to do miraculous things, it appears. But there's a lot of side effects to people that he doesn't seem to think are worthy of getting fixed up. I have not been in here. There might not be anything in here, but... Patients and hospital personnel eat the same food. That looks not great. I'm just gonna put that out there. Medicine and secret sciences. Aimed at wide public demonstrates how non-recognized sciences have influenced modern medicine. Okay. Interesting. Where did I find that those keys at? Where was I when I found those? What was this? This place draws you in and never lets you go. Where was I at? It wasn't out here. No, there was a desk. And it didn't have patients in it. Now I'll find this. Was it here? No, I don't think it was here. Somewhere else. See, now here's the issue. Because I found it. Wait, I think it was that desk. This one. Right? Got the it. key to the boiler room. All I have to do is shut off the water and hope Donovan takes the bait. Unfortunately, Miss Elizabeth is going to have to deal with the issues. Admin. Uh, boiler room. Else? Wow, this place is disgusting. I can't shut this with my bare hands. I need a tool. Okay. So we need to find something else. We'll just leave that open. Let everyone see how disgusting it is in there. Uh, let's see. Oh, you've moved. Okay, where was that guy at? Next to storage. Next to storage. He was here. There we go. That's how we figure it out. I feel guilty about Elizabeth, but I need the diversion. Let's 
so hmm. What do I do? Do I go to the bathroom? And check to see Elizabeth? Where was she at anyway? It's so easy to get lost here. I'm just running around in circles. Going like, was she here? Was she here? I'm a maniac. Hmm. Oh, it was here, wasn't it? It's temperamental, if I understand correctly. Dr. Colden, might there be a problem with the water? I was about to mention it. It seems it's been cut off yet again. I can't take this, Marie. I feel I'm gonna burst. It's not your fault if we have defective plumbing. And yet, I'm the one who gets punished because I'm gonna have to square off with that annoying old witch. Aww. Courage, Elizabeth. Here we go. And hold your tongue this time. We're gonna watch. Mr. We're gonna watch it. I'm busy. Elizabeth is not. Yes, ma'am. But it's about the water. What now? It's off. It's not my fault. Nothing is ever your fault. I told you to control the flow. Even if I know it's not your strong point. I've apologized a thousand times. I haven't counted that many. But then, unlike you, I don't have time to keep track. Please, Mrs. Donovan. I'm grateful to you for having kept me on despite that incident. I just need the water to be put back on. Otherwise, the bathroom will quickly become a nest of germs. Oh, very well. I'll finish what I'm doing, and then I'll fix your water. At last. The missing files must be hidden here. This can go very badly, very quickly. The Stendhal Syndrome. Of course. Huh. This is where Fuller found his diagnosis for Francis Sanders. <clears throat> Something is wrong with these masts. It's some sort of puzzle. Uh, oh. Uh. Huh. Nope, that's also not right. And this turns all of them. This is a thing. Patient I did files. it accidentally. Is right. Uh, okay, so next. Uh, search Fuller's office. Oh, I'm still doing that. Okay. What else am I looking for here? Oh, I'm using this. I see. Okay. 
Session number 17. Patient, Sarah Hawkins. The this finger belonged to a woman. Why keep it here? ...of what she calls the mythos. It goes without saying it's peculiar. Why is Ethan on medication? Why does Dr. Fuller write psychological reports about Sarah Hawkins? At first, I presumed that her blood was the key. But I found nothing to explain Mrs. Hawkins' abilities. Her painting? Is that what he's referring to here? The poor souls downstairs are not Fuller's only subjects. Then James came. I'm right that Charles was keeping secrets from him. I presume that he will try to break into the basement sooner or later. I am prepared. Huh. Hawkins, Fitzroy, and Fuller. What is the connection between these three? Presence of mind to set the morgue in the basement. When all the fuss about the Hawkins incident finally comes to an end, I will dispose of her belongings. Oh, her belongings are, are at least down the there. Time, they must remain hidden in plain sight. Hidden in plain sight. Okay. Hawkins is the connection. I must go back to the basement. Whew. Nobody saw anything. Nobody knows anything. Nothing happened. Not at all. Not any time at all did anything happen. Okay. Can I really not go there? I'm pretty sure I can level some stuff up, but oh well. Uh, right. So... We have to go, okay, to the high security area. Wait, is this how... Mary Colden saved us from Dr. Fuller. Is this what we're watching right now? The operating room is never accessible after an operation. I was not doing that. Fine. Um, right. Where was that place? It's not there. It's gotta be... Uh, here we go. I mean, it was somewhere down here. Right! This is exactly where we ended up at. As the uh, guy trying to escape. As Pierce. At least it looks very familiar. Oh, this is scary. Descending into madness with a stairwell like this. Was that blood? Ah, now that's the Marie that I know. I knew I could count on your scientific curiosity. It's time to show you what you were so eager to discover. Oh, did we die? Okay, so maybe that wasn't in the past. Maybe that's t if you're now, gonna today. shoot me, at least have the decency to look me in the eyes. 
turn around. Slowly. Talk, filthy thief! Oh, I swear I'll shoot! It was Charles Hawkins. Take a minute to look around. Everything points to Charles Hawkins. He's dead. No. He was here for a very specific item. Oh. No. The book. Huh. Why was it in the safe? Have you read it? Answer the question. Yep, I read it. How foolish of you. Now you won't be able to escape his will. What did it show you? She went into Fuller's office. She was looking for Sarah Hawkins' corpse. Sarah Hawkins, you say? Hmm. Let's go back to the start, shall we? So you seem much Whose more Whose life now. did the Necronomicon choose to show you? Oh, that's what Dr. it is. Dr. Colden. She was at the Riverside Institute. Riverside Institute, not She's Arkham in danger. Institute. Okay. I have to go. Wait. No one knows the occult better than me. You might need my help. Uh all, all right. right. All right. I might need you after all. Perfect. Let's meet later at the Hawkins mansion. Now this go. Affect my Rescue the doctor. Thank you, Drake. More than likely no matter what door I went into, it's Mary Colden and she was going to get attacked. So I'm not too concerned. I mean, I'm concerned. I don't want her to die. But she might be turning into a, an octopus. Which will be a change of pace for her, I imagine. 